day and it comes just in time as thousands of beer lovers get set to take over the host of city. Yeah, yeah, this is always a fun time. The Coastal Empire Beer Company is the latest to open and WJCL's Nick Dottario got a look inside, no doubt, at the sample room, huh Nick? Yeah, <laughs> no doubt about it. Thanks for coming back. I know, I'm trying to stand in place. It's not from being in the brewery. I'm trying to get my mark. Let me know if you I know. Some help. We'll get you some braces. <laughs> Well, you might recognize the name Coastal Empire Beer Company. It's been on the shelves for a few years now, but the business finally has a place of their own. The brewery opened its roads on Ro opened its doors on Ross Road. For the past several years, the company contracted with other breweries in the area. This is the third microbrewery to open in the host of city in less than three years. Last year, the city of Savannah loosened its alcohol laws and allowed breweries to give tours and tastings. Coastal Empire co-founder, Chris Haberak says he is thrilled to finally get production going. It's been a long process. Uh, the goal was always to be brewing in Savannah, and we're just uh, very excited to finally be able to do our first brew here. Haberak says they plan to brew their first batch of beer next week, and tours and tastings, get ready for this one, should begin in mid-September. Coastal Empire Beer is just one of 75 breweries participating in this weekend's Craft Brew Festival. Coming up in an hour, guys, we're going to tell you how that event makes a huge difference for these small breweries in our area. Okay, thank you, Nick. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right, we'll stay here.